video so today we are going to discuss about the four scan diagnostic tool installation process uh, before we begin a uh, four scan tool is uh, mainly uh, used for the Ford vehicles and uh, Mazda vehicles you know typical diagnosis and the reading procedure so it's very well um, you know um, designed or maybe uh, compatible with most of the Ford vehicles so that's why we thought of um, making a video about Forescan how to basically set it up and ready for any kind of diagnosis process okay so this video only dedicated just for the installation and the configuration process I mean there is nothing um, to be uh, precise about the configuration steps so but the first process is basically get into uh, the site called forscan.org so this is the official website for forscan quickly get into the website and uh, you can see the latest releases of the product just click on product and uh, what we basically need to choose what kind of uh, application we need to install so uh, it's pretty simple you need to just um, download uh, the link provided here uh, click save yeah and uh, open the setup.exe click ok Accept. Next, you can choose the target directory location or you can keep it as is. Click next. If you want a shortcut, you can keep it or you can uncheck that. Next, and yes, this is the installation process pretty much straightforward, nothing so complex here. Click finish. Okay, so before we do, I mean, again, uh, to talk about um, the four scan licenses, the installation process is even though completed. So we have a light version which is completely free. That's uh, the setup process is absolutely similar. And uh, we can go with the extended license. I mean, this is a kind of a free two uh, months free trial license we will get. Uh, and we can, uh, and otherwise, we can purchase a one year license because uh, the free version which we downloaded will not be having all the features because it will only uh, be able to read the values or maybe just you can look into what is uh, the values or you can just check the error codes etc but you cannot do any kind of a modification or whatsoever in the, the force game so what you can do is uh, to just try that you can do this extended um, a trial license or if you want to purchase for one year you can do that so that's all up to uh, you know personal preference so yeah so here uh, if, we, if you just click it so you need to fill your name uh, email address uh, and uh, you need to basically specifically mention this hardware ID so I will come to that point where you get the hardware ID so that will that will be there in your um, you know for scan software okay just click it so just open this click ok go to this steering icon so here you will get the hardware ID so just copy for copying you can just copy to the clipboard and you can paste this here okay and you fill this to details and submit uh, once you submit um, within a 30 minutes of time you will get a license key I mean it's a free license key which can, which can be used for two months okay so this is the pretty much uh, simple straightforward process so i can even show you how to basically activate this product so yes we are in this uh, for scan uh, tool so you can click into this button uh, you can basically do this by if you haven't already have been purchased uh, uh, you know one year or you know whatever purchase code if you are available you can do the activation code here or otherwise what you can do is load license key 
so how it process is basically once you i mean at the before the previous page we fill the details and the license key will get to your email and you you need to just download the key so i have already a key i can just show you how it happens so this is kind of pretty much uh, the four scan licensed key a uh, license dot key click on it and open it so right now i am uh, this is not working because this is all already an expired key so uh, if it's a valid key it will actually uh, take it for the license it's an already expired key so uh, just click on it and this will basically update uh, for the uh, you know uh, two month subscription yeah so uh, it was asking for the uh, restart okay so i'm just minimizing uh, the uh, force can application for a while and um, again show you how the kind of uh, license process also i mean what what kind of a uh, amount which comes for a one year so if you click one year extended license i i can see uh, the amount is uh, here is about 1188 i mean like it's kind of uh, for one year so if anybody wanted to do this i mean this is the procedure and you can get if you want to so it's all up to you um, personal preferences yeah so that's all the uh, kind of uh, you know uh, setup procedure so what you can do is you can um, once it is uh, you know things are being pretty much uh, installed uh, the next process you can just uh, connect the obd tool and ready to do this you know scanning procedure or whatever uh, you know modification uh, with this tool what the possibilities which you can do with this uh, for scan tool which you can do it so yeah so that's all about uh, today's video and uh, thank you for watching this video this is only talk about the installation and setup procedure i think this is a uh, very easy and straightforward uh, process yeah so thank you for uh, your time